Hey everybody, it's Downton654 Max here, and today we are going to solve more of the Rubik's Cube. So if you watched my last video, you will have the full white side with the full second layer. And the next step today is to get a yellow cross on the top. So a yellow cross like that. So you might already have it. If if you do, you might you can skip this video, I guess. But um, I would still watch it for other times when you want to solve the Rubik's cube. All right, we're gonna get the yellow cross. So there are four possible different positions that you will have on your yellow side. So you could have no yellow pieces around and just a yellow center. Well, no, you could have a yellow piece here, 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 or here, but that still counts as the center, okay? So if you just have a yellow piece in the middle, you can have the corners there as well, but is at least if you have that center, not with the edge pieces, but the center, and you can have corners as well, this is the algorithm you have to do. All right, I'm not gonna do this algorithm now because um, I don't have a center, I have a different shape, but I'll just keep this algorithm on the screen. You can pause the video if you want to right now, but um, so I'm gonna go on to the different possible shapes. So the next possible shape is an L shape, and this is the one that I have, and you might be thinking, how do I have an L shape? Well. You don't generally have a piece here. It doesn't make any difference, but, um, and I also have a piece here that doesn't really matter. The corner pieces don't really matter if you have them or not in this one, because the corner pieces. So think either than the corner pieces, okay? So just pretend the corner pieces are different colors for now, because they don't matter at all. But anyways, if you have the L shape like this, what you have to do is to keep the L uh, so it goes like this. So kind of a backwards L. It has to stay like that. And um, whatever the color is um, that keeps it in that position will be your front. So blue. And uh, actually, I should have said this earlier, but it's the same algorithm that is on the screen right now. So F U R U I R I F I and there we have the yellow cross but there is still one more possible position and that's if you have a horizontal line so you can have corner pieces once again but no edge pieces well no 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 uh you can have two edge pieces to make a line like that but not the other two edge pieces but you can't have it in a position where the line is vertical. It has to be horizontally. So if you have it in that position, you would have to do this following algorithm. F, R, U, R, I, U, I, F, I. That's on the screen right now. You can pause the video. But those are the three different possible positions to get the yellow cross. So, um... I hope you were able to get the yellow cross in this video. video. Any questions, tell me in the comment section. But um, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.